Welcome back my YouTube friends and family. This is Lindsay and I am back with more daily work from home job leads for you. In today's video we have a lot of well-known big companies like United Airlines, GoFundMe, we even have Walmart, Cash App, Yelp, and we even have a few positions from smaller companies but they are good positions like verifying employment like records where somebody works hopefully there's a little bit of something for everyone now the majority of these jobs are gonna pay a thousand dollars or more per week and a big portion of what i'm sharing does not require any kind of college degree either i have seven different positions for you today of course timestamps and links and everything is in the youtube description box below this video i just asked that if you enjoy anything that i share let me know give me that direct feedback by giving this video a thumbs up like button and of course share with all your friends and family so we can all work from home living our happiest healthiest life First up, starting off strong, we have GoFundMe. Now, GoFundMe is the fundraising website. They have 158 reviews from past and current employees on Glassdoor, an overall employee satisfaction rating of 4.0 out of 5 stars. GoFundMe is hiring a people operations generalist. Of course, this is remote for the United States. Most of everything I'm sharing is going to be for the United States. I do specialize in remote work from home jobs in the United States since that's where I live and work as a hiring manager. Now, people operations is going to be like human resources in the HR field. I have seen several comments over the last few weeks on other videos of people interested in human resources. And GoFundMe is looking for somebody to help their employees feel recognized, appreciated, and supported during their time working with GoFundMe. So you're going to support different projects as needed to improve the people operation processes, policies, programs, and systems. You're going to be that first point of contact for their global human resources related inquiries, being able to answer employee requests and questions through their internal help desk system. So you're going to partner with other other HR administration people to help when needed, like prepare exit documents, assisting with performance review management, making sure all the HR policies and procedures are up to date and good to go, just maintaining and organizing all of those employee documents and information, making sure you keep all of their private information private. Now they are looking for somebody who's a high school diploma or GED and four years of some kind of people related operations HR experience they will take a higher level of education over the experience. They're looking for somebody who can work those Microsoft Office or Google Suite, Google equivalent systems like spreadsheets, Word documents. You can basically use basic computer systems. You are highly organized and very detailed. And of course, you've got great customer service skills since you're going to be dealing with employees. Now, pay for this one is anywhere from $70,000 a year all the way up to $105,000 a year now real quickly please just note there's 52 weeks in a year so anything that is fifty two thousand dollars or more fifty two thousand dollars a year is going to be a thousand dollars a week so this one pays even more than that Moving right along, next up we have United Airlines. They have 6,700 reviews from past and current employees, an overall employee satisfaction rating of 3.9 out of 5 stars. They are looking for a specialist for their global customer solutions division. And again, this is a remote work from home position, but they are basically looking for somebody to research and partner with different departments, making sure their high profile issues are addressed and responded to. You're going to make sure that these these issues or cases that come up are properly documented, represented, and addressed, making sure that you include any public statements, DOT follow-ups. If there is a small claims court, you, you appear on behalf of United. So you are basically researching and investigating issues that are brought up and making sure you address any failures when communicating. So you're basically going to be resolving complaints. You're going to work closely with other 
organizations to establish the customer experience history for these escalated incidences or complaints. Just making sure you identify opportunities to improve the customer resolution process. Of course, pay for this is anywhere from $57,700 a year all the way up to $87,560 a year. They're looking for somebody who has two years of contact or customer service experience, someone who has great communication skills, someone who can work both independently and as a team, who has great research, analytical skills, great attention to detail. And of course, again, you knew how to work a computer using those basic computer systems like Microsoft Office, but no college degree is needed. They do prefer one, but it's not required. Keeping it moving next up, we have Walmart coming in at 128,000 reviews and overall rating of 3.4 out of 5 stars. They are hiring a resolution specialist for their contact center, and this is going to be for their dental office. Dental office experience is going to be required for this one, and this remote work from home position is only available in certain states. They are listed right here at the very top. Now, we all know Walmart as the big retail store, but we know they have pharmacies and different healthcare things in their stores but they are looking for somebody to aid in their project implementation and tracking progress for their dental. So you're going to analyze data from special record reports that are requested, escalating any concerns when needed. You're going to work with different teams recommending business solutions, identifying business needs, improving the processes of monitoring progress and adapting to change. So you will have to be taking some like inbound phone calls and taking down the issues and then researching them, analyzing them, all the things. They are looking for somebody who has one year experience in a call center, someone who has experience with dental assisting or dental insurance, receptionist, things like that. Someone who can be a critical thinker and a problem solver. They will take someone who has two years experience in retail or customer support. A high school diploma or GED is needed, no college degree. And sadly, Walmart did not list the pay for this position. That'll need to be discussed with them at the time of the interview. Moving right along, next up we have Cash App. Now Cash App has 187 reviews on Glassdoor, an overall rating of 3.9 out of five stars. They are looking for a process consultant. So this is going to be a little bit different. It's not like a customer service type position. You are going to be consulting them on their processes, looking at the processes that Cash App already has in place, looking at the policies that they have in place, and making recommendations of how they can reimagine, analyze their business processes, and improve them. So they're really looking for somebody who knows like that Six Sigma or something like that. You will lead and facilitate process improvement engagements in a range of different business stakeholders. You're going to review and analyze data, making those data-driven recommendations of how to measure in the improvement outcomes once they are put in place. So you're going to gather a lot of data, both financial and non-financial, looking at good interviewing skills, good observation skills, just performing root cause analysis to ensure improvement solutions. So a lot of analyzing data, researching, and looking to see where processes can be improved. This one pays very well, but it does require some knowledge, even though no college degree is needed. You do need to have five years of process improvement experience. Somebody who's two years experience in leading complicated improvement analysis. Someone who has great problem solving skills and great communication skills. Again, they do prefer somebody who has that Six Sigma certification. Now, pay is dependent on location. The United States is broken down into zones. Lowest pay is $89,400 dollars a year with the highest pay being $167,500 a year. And if you have great customer service skills, maybe you want to be a manager and a leader of a customer service team. Next up, we have the company Yelp, 5,200 reviews and overall rating of 3.5 out of 5 stars. 
they are looking for a manager of their customer service team. Again, this is remote for the United States. They cannot hire in the Bay Area though, just keep that in mind. But they're basically looking for somebody to just lead their customer service team. You're going to assist with hiring, onboarding, developing those team members while they're working with Yelp, conducting their one-on-one -on -one meetings, identifying areas of opportunity, and giving them feedback to help them grow in their career. So just think about if you were a customer service rep, what your manager would do for you. You'll do things like the signing off on the timesheets. You'll make sure that they are doing the job correctly, giving them training where they're needed. So you're going to provide that regular coaching, managing these team members, and resolving any escalated questions from the customer service department up. So if they're on the phone taking phone calls and someone says, can I speak to a manager? You are that manager that can handle that escalated situation. Now they are looking for somebody who has at least one year of experience developing and managing a team. So maybe you've been a team leader or something before. Someone who has a track record of motivating people. Someone who is well versed in selling digital products. It's not required, but if you know how to sell digital products or have some sales background, that is preferred. Now they will take a bachelor degree over experience or if you don't have a bachelor degree they will take three years of customer facing experience over that bachelor degree. Someone who has a great organizational skills and can handle those tough escalated conversations. Pay for this position starts at $80,000 a year and they do offer a standard benefit package. Next up, we have the company Quartzy. Now, Quartzy only has 40 reviews on Glassdoor, so I always urge you do your own research on any companies before giving them your personal information. On my website, where the links to all of these are listed, I do link the Glassdoor page too, so you can come read all the reviews from people who have worked for them. They do have a high employee satisfaction out of those 40 reviews, though, of a 4.5 out of 5 stars. They are hiring a supplier order management specialist, again, full-time remote for the United States. But Quartzy is a lab management platform, and they are looking for somebody to manage, track, and update their purchase orders for their suppliers. You will have to communicate with the suppliers on a regular basis, resolving any purchase order or fulfillment errors and discrepancies. Just working with in your team, working with the warehouse and customer support, resolving any fulfillment and receiving issues. So you'll identify and escalate these issues up to supervisors or managers. So you are managing basically the the purchase orders for suppliers, just making sure all the information is correct and those orders flow through the system and nothing goes awry. Again, no college degree is needed. They do need somebody who has two to three years of experience in either order entry, purchase order processing, or some kind of a related order management role. You got to have great English skills, somebody who can work with computer systems, customer service software systems like NetSuite, Zendesk, things like that. You got to be detail oriented and a multitasker, but pay for this position is anywhere from $45,000 a year all the way up to $55,000 a year. And of course, last but not least, we have the company MitraTech. Now, MitraTech has 335 reviews on Glassdoor and overall employee satisfaction rating of 3.9 out of 5 stars. They are looking for a verification specialist to review like employment verification. Now, one thing to quickly note about their website is that when you click the link, it's going to look like this. You're going to have to scroll down quite a bit and then you'll have a little box of text in the middle of the page and that is where the job is posted. They're looking for that verification specialist. But as a verification specialist, it says you're going to be responsible for using phone calls and sometimes video calls as well as email and fax to communicate with places like employers, schools, state boards. You're going to use online databases to verify current and previous employment and education records for people applying for jobs. This might mean also verifying their professional licensure certifications, things like that. So if someone is applying for like a, a nurse job, you'll have to make sure they are licensed as a nurse. So you're going to process these employment verifications using different mediums like email, fax, online, telephone, all the things, just providing that professional service to these third party verifiers. So a lot of companies, when they hire people, they don't do their own like background checks and employment verification, making sure that your resume is real and you've worked at the places you say you work. A lot of times they contract this out to third party companies and MitraTech is that third party country uh, company, excuse me. 
that is going to verify all these details for other companies. So you might have to make outbound phone calls, just gathering all this information, logging clear and detailed notes into the system, documenting, documenting all of your research to verify all the information you verified. So they're only requiring a high school diploma or GED and someone who's great computer skills like you can do internet searches database lookups things like that so you've got to be strongly organized great time management skills great communication skills and be a quick learner highly motivated and be professional Sadly, I did not see the salary listed for this one either. Of course, I don't work for any of these companies. I simply share what I find online. So salary will need to be discussed with them at the time of the interview. All right, if you've made it to the end of this video, I owe you a huge thank you, thank you, thank you so, so much for watching and supporting me. Feel free to leave in the comments anything specific that you're looking for. I never make any promises, but I do my best to read those and keep that in mind when I am searching for job leads to share. Don't forget, if you enjoyed any of these job leads, let me know give this video a thumbs up like button share with all your friends and family and of course i'll be back really really soon with more work from home job leads just for you